Yeah. Sometimes I say Nanga on television, you know, sometimes I say, now Nanga is lying. <laughs> you see him looking, looking for explanation. Poor man. <laughs> <laughs> and when things go wrong, I tell, I tell the general boss, you go to parliament. Fortunately, the boss is very smart. <laughs> Sometimes he goes there and see him playing with words. <laughs> you know the problem, but... <laughs> you start now looking for... Well, what, now, what do I say? <laughs> you know the problem, you know the, but uh, you have no solution. So, ladies and gentlemen, draw up a list of your requirements. We go on to government and say, whatever you are doing, we need this money. So government, rationalize your priorities. Rationalize your priorities. If you want a robust police force, an adequate prison service, a robust immigration service, this is what we require. Yeah, that's forgetting Nira and uh, the other fellows. These, these ones. Well, you know. There are certain government institutions which are a sine qua non for government to exist, for a country to exist. A police, a police force is one of those institutions which need uh, support, maximum support. So, and I will do this for you for as long as I'm what? I'm around. And I'm not around for a long time, gentlemen. I'm, I'm getting old. I'm getting dilapidated like, like an old Land Rover. <laughs> yeah. So, but while we are around, let's, let's put our hands together and see what we can push. So that uh, Ochoa and I and uh, Katsugas and some of you leave a legacy. Yeah. We can leave a legacy. Then we can pin a wing here and say, Winnie, you let us down. But then we should also have a, pr a plan. I think these are mainly the kind of things I wanted to talk about. Uh, welfare, uh, structure, and then um, uh, this business of crime. From the reports we get, this wave of crime is a bit interesting. Some of it is political, some of it is sheer crime, others you get uh, there is internal collaboration. Like this man in the, this police officer who drew through a gun in Rangeli, this one in Chiruhura. Sang. Uh, surely that was not rebel activity or criminal activity. It was the, <laughs> it was connivance. It was connivance. Where is Damurira? Yeah, you are here. Now, Damurira, you remember the other thing we were discussing about Nairobi? Nairobi, the ones who are going to, the, our friends who had problems in Wujiri, you know, <laughs> I have now discovered some of the people who were taken for the demonstration were border border accidents, accident victims. <laughs> yes, border border accident victims. People took to Nairobi border border accident victims and claimed these were victims of torture. Sit down. That's the integrity of our politicians. Of the people they took, some were border border victims, accident, accident victims. That's the integrity of our police, politicians. Now, gentlemen, I can't be party to this. I can't be party to that tomfoolery. Yeah. We should investigate those who did this, this kind of thing and bring them to, to, to account. How do you take people who were knocked by, fell down on their border borders, and you go parade them before international press and say these were torture victims, tortured by the police, I don't know, by CMI, or by, I don't know. No. This is criminal. This is criminal, and those people who did that should be brought to book. If this is not politics, no. It has now gone beyond the bounds of what? Or politics that has become criminal. This is this is treason. This is treason. I'm not saying that some of you are holy. You beat up people. You do what? Uh, for which you should be arrested, because when you beat a suspect, you should be arrested. Nobody should be beaten. But please, don't say the police has killed somebody who has never been born. 
that this fellow was murdered a man who has never been born. <laughs> Where did they find him? Where they, <laughs> that they have killed him. <laughs> a man who died 10 years ago. Eh? The man died 10 years ago. Now you're saying they have killed him. Eesh. So, these are some of the things I wanted to bring to your attention and uh, to address you. I am very grateful for your effort. So far, so good. <laughs> yeah, so far, so good. The new regime, the Ochora regime, has brought a bit of sanity in the police and the group that is running the police now. I can see a bit of improvement. Yeah. Of course, like, uh, who is this man who said he wanted more? Is it? All were twist. Like, all, all were twist. <laughs> I want more. The Baganda said, see my Like, all were twist. I want more. I want more. Yeah. But, but I also appreciate you are.